What's going on guys, it's Yvonne. In this video I wanted to make a short video on how you can make a strike through through your tech, something really useful. So if you have something like this item today going for 40 bucks, um, but can be yours today for 10 bucks, something like that, it may be more visually appealing if you have a little strike through, you know, it causes that little that little um, thing to go off in the people's brain saying, oh yeah, cool, so, so that no longer exists, I'm getting this cool deal, okay? So here, actually, I have the example from which we worked on before, uh, where we changed our color. Over here, you can see the video how we changed our font um, size to any font, uh, text size to any uh, size we wanted. But let me just show you how to do this. So suppose we want to cross out that first section, standard item price, and just leave the bottom, right? can be yours today. So let me just, um, let me just make them all the same size just for consistency. All right, and now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add a command just before, which is gonna be uh, in the brackets, uh, in the triangle brackets is gonna say DEL, okay? So all I'm gonna do, put this DEL, close it, that's it. So now what this is going to do is this is going to keep that command for the entire duration of whatever sentence I have, okay? So, well, let me just show you, okay? So it's gonna look like this, perfect, mission accomplished, okay? And if you wanna see videos on how to change the color or the font, uh, the text size, just take a look at these videos here. Uh, but let me show you, suppose you want, suppose you want only that 75 to be strike through, or you want item and, just to make it a bit more complicated to, to, to give you guys an idea for how to do it, I'm going to create a strike through through the word item and through the number 75. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually not going to put it there. I'm going to delete that strike through. And I will put a strike through right before the word item. So let's let's look for the word item up here, up top somewhere. Standard item right here, okay? So just before that, I'm going to put a command and I'm going to say del. And then what this does is now this creates a strike through for the entire thing. But we don't want that. We only want it around item. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go right after the word item. I'm going to create another command and I'm going to say slash del and that creates the strike through only through the word item. Uh, let me just create a space there. Okay. Now, unfortunately it's going to cause a little strike through there. Uh, but at least you have that strike through, right? So let me now create a strike through through the number 75. So we're going to do the same thing. Let's find 75 del and let's close it slash del right afterwards okay there you go that's it um so that's how you add it let me just make sure um that's fine and then for item okay so there's a space there okay so that's fine let me just see what happens if i delete the space here along with that we should just delete a space overall yeah so what we should do let me see if I can actually create the line without it going going ahead one spot. So what I'm going to do right after is I'm actually going to copy that space. So I'm going to, so let me see. So the code for space is, um, let me just add a space and then see what it's going to look like. I'm going to add a space. And then what I'm going to do is you see here, right after item, it's got space. What I'm going to do is I'm going to copy it, including the semicolon. I'm going to cut it. And I will add it right after the word delete. And I'll probably add, yeah, that's fine, okay? So I'm just gonna add that little um, space right after my stop delete command, okay? And that's going to make it much nicer so that I don't have the line going through that little space as well, all right? Uh, so that's about it. I hope that helped. Now you know how to create strike throughs for whatever you want. Once again, if you want to strike through for the entire thing, uh, just write it at the bottom or write it at the beginning and just don't, don't leave the, don't write the deletes with a forward slash uh, unless you want it to end there, okay, at that point. Um, so that's about it then. Thanks for watching. If you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, please leave them down below. Uh, if there's anything you, you want me to go over, let me know as well. And please subscribe. Thank you to those of you that have already subscribed. I do appreciate it. Um, and I will see you guys in the next video.